Welcome to TTI. Welcome to a whole new world of science and fun. Today, we're counting down the top 10 modified cars, which are incredible. So be sure to put your seatbelt on and be ready to enjoy this thrilling video. Number 10. If you think Bigfoots don't exist, then of course you are wrong. If you still are in doubt, then be ready to meet Bigfoot. Designed by a great motor enthusiast, Bob Chandler, in 1974 in the U.S. Professionally, Bob drove a robust vehicle, Ford F-250 for off-roading adventure in his free time. But Bob pushed it hard, breaking the axles and burning out the engines, only to find out that replacements were difficult in the St. Louis area. That's when an idea began to form. Bob created Midwest four-wheel drive to fill that 4x4 gap. The first Bigfoot had 48 inches tall, four-wheel steering, and a supercharged eight-cylinder engine. Bob unveiled the biggest of the monster trucks, standing 5.7 meters tall and weighing 17,200 kilograms, 38,000 pounds. They did some sponsor show off at Denver Car Show in summer 1986. The truck was intentionally created with these large tires, which originally came from a huge vehicle used in Alaska by the U.S. Army. Number 9. Photo Camera Car We know that people love selfies. Google has spinning cameras for 3D maps, but Harrods Blank's camera van had a different goal. Back in 1993, an insane idea was coming into existence. The van was covered with a lot of cameras on its exterior surface. It might be the best choice for YouTube pranksters. <laughs> the primary intention was to capture people's faces and their surprising reactions. In 1995, the van began its journey across America. Blank was documenting the astonished looks, bewildered faces, and pointing onlookers with the cameras docked onto the vehicle. Since the first departure, Bank has taken his van to Canada and even overseas to Britain and Germany to find thousands of different faces with the same range of reactions to his attention-grabbing creation. Number 8. Ghost Car Apparently, this SUV, Nissan Patrol, looks like an ordinary car, but don't be fooled by its outer appearance. To understand more, we have to open the door. <gasps> oh my gosh, after opening the door, you can see the absence of steering wheel, accelerator, and brakes. I think this ghost car from Dubai is worthy of publicity. Are you wondering how it works? So, don't overthink. Let me unveil the hidden secret. Actually, the steering wheel, accelerator, and brake, all of these are precisely installed at the back side of the car. And driving this unusually modified car is a really challenging job, I bet. <laughs> Number 7. Pool Table Car if you have an intense obsession towards a car and a pool table, then you may appreciate Vinnie Bergman for his creative work. He combined both his old car and pool table. For this, he selected Chevrolet Monte Carlo from late 90s. Thanks to new powerful engine, this pool car can achieve 100 miles per hour or 160 kilometers per hour. Number 6. Spa Car Hot Tub Yes, probably you've all heard about Nazi scientists because of their crazy experiments and incredible inventions. But right now, we are living in the future, where some of the greatest scientists have emerged on YouTube, like Crazy Russian Hacker, Hacksmith, and now Colin Furze. Colin Furze is a British garage inventor and one of my favorite YouTubers. He converted his 28-year-old BMW car into a hot tub on the wheel. Sealing every holes and gap in car's interior is essential. That ensures there is no leakage. Filling tremendous amount of water was a real challenge to the car's old suspensions. That's the reason Colin installed the additional suspension coils for the smoother ride. 
The unique waterproofing material used to protect the sensitive components and electrical wires. Moreover, they mounted two blowers for making bubbles and covered the car with artificial lawn grass. I think this car might be the best for picnics because his crazy car even has built-in mini kitchen to cook meat. All those features combined make this car perfect for summers. <laughs> Number 5 Ford Fairmont Snow Tank In the last few years, the Ford Fairmont has become a trendy platform among drag racers due to being inexpensive, lightweight design that allows the wide range of modifications. One man from Saskatchewan in Canada was tired of people due to not getting their attention to his 1978 Fairmont. After getting inspiration from the movie Taxi, he transformed his old car into a tank. Arguably the coolest Fairmont we may have ever seen, the owner took a Fairmont project and made it into the ultimate Arctic cruiser. Its body was installed on snowcat chassis with extra wide tracks. This grandma sedan can go anywhere, even in harsh and extreme places where no other Fairmont has gone before. The owner has decided to sell his car at fifteen thousand dollars. Number four, Stubby Bob. Probably you're thinking, what's unique about this garbage truck? Two famous engineers, Mike Finnegan and David Freiberger, from a YouTube channel Roadkill, took a 1950s Ford F6 dump truck and shortened the wheelbase to just 102 inches so that it would look freaking awesome. Instead of old tractor engine, they decided to replace that with a new Chevrolet big block V8 engine, which was precisely installed behind the driver's cabin. Starting the engine of this truck is one of the greatest experiences for engine enthusiasts. A new life is given to the truck with the support of Optima Batteries, CRC Industries, Lincoln Tech, Cooper Tire. Even though this Bob truck works fine, but still, it needs a lot of work to complete this project. Number 3 What will happen if we combine two cars? Of course, the result will be strange and ridiculous. To find out the answer to this question, Fred and Dave attempted to build one vehicle that can run on all types of terrain. They combined an old Range Rover with a Ford Ranger to build pre-Range Rover Land Runner, which can also play in the mud and rock crawl. They safely cut all unnecessary parts without interfering with the gas connection. With a lot of hard working, they welded two half cars into one piece. Now there is two driving cabins, two steering wheels, two engines, and two drivers with double the fun. But it still looks ridiculous and awesome at the same time. Number 2 Maybe you're bored with your old car with the same permanent color and want to repaint your car in another color of your choice. But unfortunately, you're not so rich like Rainbow Shake, who has seven cars in seven different color variants. Just like my closet. But don't worry, here we have a few solutions that you can try. Now you can change your car's color or pattern by using thermochromic tone. The thermochromic paint is the same material that is found in mood rings and under the screens of smartphones or LCD. This material, when exposed to heat, the molecular structure changes. It reflects different color on warm condition. The thermochromic paint intentionally prepared in such a manner that it will change its color at 37 degrees Celsius, which is our body temperature. This color under warm water becomes translucent, revealing the car's true colors. After a few moments, the paint becomes opaque again. Paramagnetic color is another magical solution. They can change color under the influence of electricity. If you have paramagnetic paint, then changing color is as easy as pressing a button on a remote. Hydra color is another color 
which has the ability to change its color under the influence of moisture. Number one. Brazilians are very fun-loving people and love loud sounds. But one person changed the definition of loudness. Alan Dante is a world champion for several years in Brazil. He modified his car into the loudest car due to its ability to produce 184.6 decibels of loudness. As we know, more than 185 decibels is fatal and can damage your eardrum or may destroy ears anatomical functions. Such sound has same destructive power as experiencing an explosion of 1 kilograms of TNT but at 18 meters away from the center of the explosion. The Team Hail car is one of the loudest cars in the world with the most powerful audio system, which consists of nine subwoofers, nine amplifiers, and 60 batteries. Being a medical professional, my advice to you guys is that please stay away from it <laughs> because precaution is better than the cure. Thanks for watching. Which card do you find most impressive? Let me know in the comment section. If you're new here, then feel free to subscribe and be my friend. Don't miss our upcoming videos by clicking on that bell icon. I'll catch you guys later in my next episode. Peace!